guys uh, welcome to my third set of yoga um, today we're gonna be working upper body we're gonna be concentrating on our upper body so get ready to have us some good workout um, we're gonna be using the block if you have a block you can have it next to you or you can use anything that you have that can be um, this high or this high, okay? Um, we're gonna start by sitting on a comfortable way. My comfortable way is this. You can do also uh, crossing your legs on a lotus pose. Um, and we're gonna start uh, by closing our eyes. We're gonna concentrate on today's practice, on getting here, present, um, centering your mind into what is worth it today our health our family our today not it's what is going to happen tomorrow we don't know anything so it's good that we we center our thoughts to positive to being here to be present to be healthy and to be able to help others by just staying home. Now we're gonna start by uh, we're gonna start with child pose. Now we need to stretch. So you're gonna sit. Try to feel that you're sitting on your heels or your car is fine. You can also put your if you, if it is too tight, you can just put sit on your on your block and just gonna stretch your arms feel a nice stretch on your back on the laterals on your arms side to side and stretch inhale and exhale again let's give one last breath here Feel that nice stretch. I'm now stretching on my towards my left side. So I'm feeling it on my right side really nicely. Now let's do it. Opposite side. And let's feel that nice stretch on our sides. you breathe the more you will open up your body will be more flexible so always breathe easy
Arme sehr lüft. Exhale, Hand on your heart. We're gonna do it again. We start with Tadasana, Mountain Pose, and inhale, Arme sehr lüft. Exhale, Forward Fold. Inhale, Tabla Lift, Arme Tadasana. Exhale, Forward Fold. Join for high planking, four, five, and five, four, three, two, one. Inhale, forward pose, and downward facing dog. Very good job. Feel the body opening up. Those legs opening up. Feel that your kneecaps are up to so engage more your quadriceps. Again, if you cannot, if you bend your knees, it's fine. It's your own practice. Everyone's in, on a different level, and that's fine. Now look forward. Feet forward on the floor. And Inhale, Ardha Uttanasana. Exhale, Uttanasana. Inhale, arms look. Exhale, arms on your heart. And then do this one last time. Get ready. You can pause. Get the power again. We're gonna do it again. We're gonna breathe and connect one more, one more time. And inhale, arms and salute. Exhale, more fold. Inhale, how we lift. Exhale, come to the floor. And high planking. This time it's time to stay on high planking and slowly pull it lower. Five, four, three, two, one. Good job. Inhale, power pose. Exhale. And downward facing dog. Very good. Now we want you to go on your knees. It's going to go to our knees. Now we want you to inhale and raise your left hand. Exhale. Bring it inside. You're gonna raise your head and you're gonna bring your hand, right hand behind, just holding your thighs. Let's stay here for a few seconds. Relax, feel a nice stretch on your shoulders. Breathe. You try to start feeling that your shoulder, your right shoulder is opening up towards the ceiling. So just open more. And now we get tight. Our flexibility is not the best, but this is the idea. To get that flexibility better. So feel also that your hips are square and you're raising your right hip. You're keeping it on the floor, rounded, square. And exhale. And you're gonna bring your right hand in front. Your left hand is gonna end it. You're gonna extend it. Square your shoulders. Bring it forward. And as you inhale, you like when I go on downward facing dog and three leg. Very good. From here, you're gonna inhale and bring your right left leg in front. Very good. And from here, we're just gonna bring our knee down. You can tuck your knee if it's too um, painful and 
we're gonna raise our arms up. I'll use your feet that you're bringing your, your leg back to touch your, your skin. And we're gonna start bringing our arms down on a cross position. Chest out. There you go. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. One more time. Inhale. Exhale. Feel like you're pulling something really heavy. You're engaging your, your back, your triceps. Now you're going to go over and we inhale and exhale. Very good. One more time. Exhale. Good job. Last time. And exhale. Awesome. Now we're gonna go down to the floor. We're gonna untap your leg. From here, we're gonna bring that leg back. And we're gonna raise our left hand. We're gonna just go here for 10 counts. One, two, three. You can put your knee also, huh? Four, like this, yes. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Come back, forward, and this time we're gonna open. The other side, we're gonna extend our arm and come back. Now, slowly we're gonna go to Chakraya in five, four, three, two, one, and our facing dog, the our facing dog, the downward facing dog. Let's stay here for a few counts. How did you do? I hope it's fine. And now we're gonna do, go on our knees because we're gonna do our other side, right? So inhale, raise your right hand, exhale, bring it inside, and take your left hand and bring it to your hips. We're gonna stay here for a few seconds, breathing. And as you breathe, you're gonna take your left shoulder and you're gonna try to open it without raising your uh, left knee. Open it as much as you can. This is my maximum. So don't worry, we are almost on the same level. It is all about practice, and this is what we're doing, trying to practice to get better every day. Good job. Now, inhale, raise your arm. Put your left hand on the floor and help yourself to stand up. And you're gonna bring your right hand to the side. Shoulders are square, and you're gonna bring it forward, tag your feet, and you're gonna go for three legs, downward facing dog, good job, you're gonna be here, you're gonna raise your right leg and bring it in front, hands front, you're gonna tag your left knee, if, you, if it's needed, put it on, on your mat, and we're gonna raise our arms. We're gonna hold that bar. We're gonna bring it down. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, chest open, exhale. Feel like you're really pulling something very heavy. Down. Time. Feeling it 
complete you are. One last time. Inhale and exhale. Now you're gonna come close and open. Squeeze it. Inhale. Raise your right arm up as you inhale, 
as you can. This is my maximum. But the nice of practice, like I said. So we're going to continue practicing as much as we can. Inhale, raise your left arm on your hand and push your right hand on the floor. Now, inhale, raise your Right hand, bring it in front. We're going for three legs. Now we're facing up. Raise your right leg and move forward. We're going to attack the knee, the dead double. We're going to move your arms up, hold the imaginary bar and do the same. to let it go. This is warrior three. Now we're gonna keep those hands hidden on your chest and we're gonna extend it. It's up to you how much um, balance you have. And now we're gonna hold it again. But check this out. We're going for halfway, half moon. So half moon is something like this. And I'm trying to find my balance also. Breathe and 
Bring the leg forward. Bring it. Go. Good chair. Collapse, try to bring your body to the center, your palms to the center of your chest. Also, your knees shouldn't be one forward, should be all parallel to each other. Come back to the center, extend your arms. two times. Now, we're gonna do it again with the other leg, okay? Let's try. And we're gonna inhale and push your left leg back. You need the block, you can use the block. Remember to keep your back straight in a nice line. Your toes are facing down. Your toes, front toes are facing the front. I'm gonna let go. I'm gonna try to find that line balance with our hips square. I'm gonna extend those arms. Very slowly, you're gonna come back. I'm gonna try to find that half way, half moon, sorry. Half moon. Oops. Same as long as it. Okay, so now we're gonna let go. Let go. Good. And we're gonna bend on these knees and come back to one, two. Bring the knee up to the outside and bend it. Bend your arms. Very good. Inhale. And then two, double spin. Exhale. Yeah. 
slowly try to touch the floor with your flat. A lot, it's so good. Repeat and in turn and come back to the center. I'm going for a happy baby pose, which is a really nice, it really makes me happy. And this is a, the best name for this for this pose. Pulse. Remember to push. It's like if you're pushing your legs towards the floor. Five, four, three, two, and one. Positive. I know these times are very scary, but um, we gotta continue thinking positive because this is where it's gonna keep us going. And here, um, if I can help in anything else, just let me know. But I'm super happy that the channel is growing and that. I see a lot of people doing the workouts. So thank you very much. In yoga, I'm starting, so I'm slowly, slowly grow. Thank you so much for keeping up with me. And see you tomorrow.